winter tube. Right. <laughs> Today's job. I cannot stress how tall this, this is. Sort of chest high. This grass. In fact, some of it is shoulder high. Uh, one of my most popular videos on YouTube is a, a cutting back of tall grass. And uh, I don't know whether it was because of how I put across this video or what, but I said, can you do a better job than a certain YouTuber? Unfortunately, it did get a bit misread. So I'll show you what I'm doing. So that's my grass. And if I try and stand here, I mean this bit here, See, it's up to be waist. So this is waist high, uh, very, very thick grass. So plan of, of attack is to stream it first. Which is what I always stand by, stream first. You don't put a mower out of this. And then uh, mow over it. And uh, I shall endeavour to explain how or what I meant last time uh, and it's basically <coughs> the old adage another famous youtuber a silk purse from a, a sow's ear right so I'm going to chop the grass back there which is what I've been told to do it's going to be a pain but never mind <coughs> so yeah can you make a silk purse from a sow's ear well this isn't going to look pretty uh, the difference is I'm going to be using my roller mower so I shall be putting a bit of a stripe down on this <laughs> if, it, if you can call it that uh, so we shall see what this looks like I'll take a photo from here and we'll see how well it looks after I've done and on that video I was mentioning this famous youtuber and it kind of sounded like uh, I could do a better job and I should have um, made it a bit more clearer. Can you do a better job? And the answer was no. Uh, so my question is now, and I shall uh, have to explain this in more detail, in detail, so that you can understand. Is my roller mower going to make it look better? And I can't answer that until I finish. But my guess is going to be no. Right, I don't know why that video is very popular, uh, but it's called um, Cutting Back Long Grass or something like that, I can't remember. Uh, but it's my uh, one video that's had the most views. So, similar sort of job, similar sort of scenario. I'll speed it up and put the yakety sax over the top.
so much for that plan. That's how far I am. I've tried to mow over this, but it just it ain't cutting. You can see it was just really, really dense, thick grass here. And all I'm doing is just clogging up the mower. I've still got to strip. I've already trimmed this twice. And I've still got to trim that area again. As you can see, there's clumps of grass everywhere that I was blowing away and I was blowing it all the way along there and then picking it up. But the rain, heaven's just opened up. I've done this area here. So, <laughs> should have caught that on film. So I've done this area. Uh, I strimmed it just for once, this one and then blew all the grass around the end down here all the grass is just behind the building so no waste taken away had one car he covered himself just absolutely hammered through uh, I'll tell you, show you how much rain we've had <laughs> washing my grass away let's do me a favour I think we have a bit of a flood You can see it's starting to rain again now, and uh, it's quite uh, dark over there. So I'm going to have to come back, and I don't want to do that, but I'm got, I've got no choice. It's going to have to come back on my day off to finish this off, and I'm hoping it's not raining. I need it to be dry. I don't like leaving it like this, but there's nothing I can do. I can't blow it or sweep it or anything. I hate leaving a job half done, I really do. As I say, I have tried, you can see the difference. I've tried mowing this, but it's it's not too bad. But the reality is I could do a better job than that. I still want to trim around the edges and what have you, but I've got a bit of trimming around there to do. So... You never know, I might be able to get the drone out again and uh, do a bit more footage with the drone. But uh, the question was, I mean, this isn't anywhere, this isn't, this isn't anywhere near as bad as how bad this was. This was terrible. But you can see the roller mower is, uh, I've got to say, it's done its justice. It does uh, put a stripe down. It just makes it look tidy. It, it, I don't know, there's something about putting a stripe down. I mean, if you look here, even here, it just looks at just that little bit better than just using a four a four wheeled mower because you don't have the track marks. You just have a nice stripe. I think it just looks a little bit tidier. And once I've done all around the edge in the weekend, I don't think there's a curb here, so all I'm going to do is just use a strimmer along here. I'll trim the edges here and then maybe edge it with the lawn edger. I don't know. We'll see. Right, I'm going home now. It's probably about six o'clock now, so, and uh, it, the rain's getting heavier, so I shall go home and hopefully there will be a part two, or this will be in one great big long video. Well, I'm gonna do a quick video before I start, and uh, what I'm gonna do is, I'm back here again, after the rainstorm, so I've gotta cut all that now. I was gonna stream it, but today, after using this in the wet and in the rain and in long grass, I'm going to have a go at mowing this first with that and uh, I'm just going to do a quick test before I get the drone out if it works then I'll get the drone out and I'll film myself cutting with this and then I shall cut with the roller mower once I've cut with this and uh, yeah we'll see how it gets on today it's uh, dry